Hello, it's Richard from Tyne Valley Aquatics and today I'm going to show you modifications that I've made to the internal filter that uses the K1 media. Um, this is the same as before, which is basically just a bottle. Watch the, watch the how to make a moving bed video to learn how to make it. The extra thing is this, which is a piece of 20 mil overflow pipe you get from a plumbing center with a bend on and another piece of 20 mil pipe with lots of little holes drilled in it. The foam that I'm using on here was just some old foam that we had lying around in the shop it fit quite well, it's got a nice big surface area. Um, there's a couple of suckers on the back which actually keep that stuck to the back of the tank and in here we've got the air stone what happens with this one is as the air is getting pumped in and your air stone sitting inside of here as it's getting pumped in the air is being forced up here and water is being sucked through the foam which helps to keep the water clear when the air comes up into the bottle there's holes drilled around here so it also sucks water in through here so one air pump can run the filter which draws from here and here and then you've got your K1 on the top which it cleans your, your water biologically and holes drilled in here to spit the water out so air pump in air water gets drawn in here and here water gets spat out up here giving you a good turnover in your tank now that we've got the new filter made and I've put mature K1 in just so it works straight away we'll try it in the tank see what it's like